Hey, back up, cat. Place is a jackpot, that's for sure. Went deep enough to get more diamond though in the walls. I'm gonna have to go down farther. I wonder how your little brother is doing. Or sister. We have to figure out who the boy and who the girl is. I'm thinking Blaze is the is the male, Nether's the girl. Yeah, I think so. Meow. Whoa, whoa, why are you being so pushy, girl? That's a regular size. It's not a cave spider. All right, let's get back to the base. But first, you know one thing about the cats, though, I, I they make. Too much noise when they're walking. And <laughs> I can't tell if it's a cat or if it's something else. <coughs> yes, indeed, do. I heard you. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Hey, now. So I don't know if you guys have ever played good old Quake or Unreal Tournament from the yesterday, from the yesteryears. Uh, but some of the best mods that we played, one was Action Quake, which was a lot of fun. I think they actually came out with an Action Half Life, which we played that one as well. So it was a modification for. Well, the first, uh, I think the, the original was for Quake. And then when Half-Life came out, they made one for Half-Life. That was a lot of fun. You could, there were, it was more, um, there were modern weapons. And there were some items in the game that you could use. I don't think there were classes, but you could pick different characters. And some of the characters I remember, one was uh, Odd Job was the guy I used to play all the time. <laughs> Which was like this big thug. Odd job, but I think there was like uh, Matrix characters, and and they were basically just skins. I don't think they had any class type attributes or anything like that. But I remember there being um, Action Quake. Was that the one we could kick? I think you could kick people. Yeah, that might have been with the kicking. So you could kick somebody and send them flying. So we would try to do that when you're up on rooftops and stuff we would send each other sailing off the roofs with a big kick uh, let's see what do we have here um, well cat I don't know if we should leave now or what but got a lot of stuff here I've got my diamond three diamonds I'd like to search around a little bit more and see if I can get down lower Like that looks like that goes down. I follow that water down a little lower. Oh yeah, wow, check that out. And here we have a natural cavern. Interesting. In fact, is this the way I came down? Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. This is exactly the way I came down. We're gonna have a good time tonight. Yep. Right over here. Up this way. Mushrooms. This is actually a couple of days after since I've played this. I took a few days off. The weekend has passed. It's now Monday, so I had stopped in the middle of that story and just picked up. So, um, trying to remember where the heck I was. 
So, all right, let's go back and get some goodies. We'll head back topside. I may. Ooh, there's lava. <laughs> that was weird. Why does it do that? I thought that was fixed. I was thinking maybe I would go down down that way and see what's down there. But you know what? It's probably not even worth it. Come on, kitty. I'm just going to collect all this stuff. Let's make a new axe. And make an iron axe. And make a diamond pick, actually. But not yet. Um, can make an iron shovel. No, that's all I'm going to do for now. What I'm going to do, and I'll probably do this off camera, is just collect some of this wood. Do your job, cat. There you go. Where are you going? Come back. <laughs> wow, is he running or what? Seen enough, huh? So maybe I'll bring some of this wood topside and build a little cabin. That's what we'll do. So uh, why don't we do that in the next episode? So I think we're going to say farewell for now. Me and Kitty, I'm going to pack up some of this stuff and head topside. And we will take it from there. All right, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Endercat, let's go. I'm all packed up, all the goodies in my backpack. And it's time to head back to the surface and build a house. I know you want to stay. The other cat keeps giving me those little Puss in Boots eyes. I don't... We'll be back. We'll be back. There's plenty to see. Lots more to do here. And that's why we're going to build a house. So we can take our time. <laughs> oh. Did you see a creep? I did see a creeper. I did. I did see a creeper. Hey, buddy. Come here. Ender. Check it out. Get him. It's in the water. Whoa. Where'd he go? He's gone. Oh, there. Oh. <laughs> Ender. Help me out. Keep him away. I don't like creepers in the water. Got him. Nah. No gunpowder. Okay, let's go. I got gypped. Uh, ooh, chicken, chicken, chicken. Do you hear that? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Come on. It's dinner time, cat. You might make it home for dinner. And I have a chicken for you. Oh. All right, stick with me. Chicken around here somewhere. Oops, iron. Looks like I missed a little iron here, kitty. Oh, oh in the cave, too. With zombies. All right. Well, the zombies are going to have to wait. Zombies are going to have to wait. Where'd you go? Actually, let's just take a quick peek. Oh, my God. <gasps> it's a dungeon! Endercat, come here! It's a zombie dungeon! Not a very good dungeon, but it's... Endless dog food. Just need a dog. Ender, come here! Ender doesn't want to look because... Ender doesn't like dogs. And this means we're going to get a dog, buddy! Nice cocoa beans! Sweet! Iron bread. There's some gunpowder. Whoa! Hello! Where the heck did he come from? Oh! Great. Get a torch and I get a spawn. Okay. Uh, nice work on the guard duty there. Cocoa beans. Oh, yeah. All right. We're going to leave the flesh here. I'll take the cocoa beans. Um, wow. This is sweet. I guess I'll take the string. And I'm just we'll just come back for the rest, all right? But now that we know this is here, this is great. Right under my nose, too. So close to the house. 
So close to our house as soon as we build it. Some iron there. Oh, yeah. What? Must be a little darkness here still. That ought to do. Oh, man. Okay. It's too bad I can't stack those buckets. Um. Yeah, we'll come back for the rest. At least we know what's here. Endless dog food. And... More iron. You know what? I don't trust you there. I think this is with the... Oh, yeah. Yep. This is the ravine with the lava. You stay right there. I do not trust you near lava. Just gonna take a quick peek, my friend. Wow, look at the iron. Awesome. Oh, dear. It's the sheep. It's the sheep I was telling you about. You know the one that came to my dinner? The dinner party? Grand opening of Heidi Hole? Yeah, he's out there. And I'm afraid he's going to do something stupid. He's way up on the cliff. Let's go get him, poor little fella. Oh, I feel bad. I feel bad. Come on, let's go give him a hand, Endercat. I think we can help him off that uh, little precipice. Where is he? Oh, dude. Dude, just just wait right there. We're going to give you a hand. Endercat, come on. Go talk him out of that. All right, just stay right there. We'll help you out. Um, we'll just get you a new skeleton. In fact, there's there's one right down there. You can have zombies, skeletons, whatever you want. All right, Endercat. Let's, um, come on, let's help him down. Oh, boy. This is going to get hairy. Don't move. This is delicate work, Endercat. Here, I'll take down this way. Yeah, get him. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. All right, yeah, 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 good, good. All right, you talk him down. You keep him company. Oops, ow, sorry. Sorry. Oh, what I do? Yeah, you talk him. Just make him happy, and then I will come down and... Wait, wait, no, no! 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 Andrew Cat, that's not... I didn't mean... That's not what I meant. I was gonna... <laughs> okay. Uh, I was gonna make a little way for him to climb out. That was the whole point. Yeah. Uh, well, we got... I guess you got the wrong message there. Um, I was trying to save him, not kill him. Endercat. Seems like my Endercat has a, a little mean streak there. Yeah. Hope you feel bad about that. <laughs> Jeez. Well, I guess that's why we call you Endercat, right? Get a little dark streak in you. Okay. Remind me not to make you angry. Blaze! Blaze! We missed you! Hey, buddy! All right, Ender, get over here. Come on. Your turn for guard duty. Yes. That's your punishment for killing that poor, innocent little sheep. I never said to push him off. I said we're going to help him down. Help him down meant get him up onto the edge of the cliff and safe, not push him down. Ah, boy. Okay, let me uh, get organized here. Cocoa beans, pretty sweet. Look at all the iron. Oh, baby. Diamond. I'm going to make a diamond pick pretty much immediately. Melon seeds. We have bones. I'm going to hang on to the bones. And we have mushrooms. You know what I'm going to do is grow some of these. Uh, let's get this iron going. Don't need the rail right now. The chest I may bring with me for a short while. Yeah, okay, so let's talk about the plan here. I don't need the wool. Um, the plan is going to be... You want to come in? Did you miss me? I missed you. I think what we'll do is build a house here. Now, I know in the beginning of this series, I said that I was going to uh, kind of be a nomad and wander around and explore an adventure and we'll, we'll still do that but this is a great spot i've got this cavern down there cavern down here the ravine over there which this i'm sure intersects um we now have a dungeon nearby which is awesome 
we've got multiple biomes, varied biomes. The the desert here, we've got jungle all around, the snow biome. This is a good spot just to settle down for a little while, don't you think? And what I'll do is I'll just build a house for a little while. We'll stay here for a little while. I don't know. 10, 20 episodes, and then we'll move on. I mean, the goal here is to get to the nether, uh, and then get to the end, rather. So we're going to need to find a stronghold. I mean, the whole bit. There's there's a, a huge process. And the process is going to take us all over the place. So we're not going to be sitting in one spot, but I do... I, I kind of want to build a house and a farm and just be like a colonist, you know? Like a frontiersman. That's the way I like to play this game. So rather than wander aimlessly, we'll do that. And I will get started on that in the next episode. I think what I'm going to do now is take a break and... Uh, have a little chat with my cats here. We're going to talk about that little mean streak that uh, Ender seems to have. Ooh, Blaze, you should have seen it. <laughs> Just pushed him right off the edge. Yep. Interesting. All right. And, uh, oh, we need a dog, too. Now that we have all this endless dog food at the dungeon, we're going to get a dog. I know you guys don't like that prospect, but I'm sorry. That's the way it's got to be. All right. I'm going to go in here, get organized with the inventory. I'm probably going to collect some wood off camera. We'll pick a nice little spot for a house, and um, we'll start building the cottage in the next episode, and, and farms, etc. All right, so I'm going to say farewell to you all, give you a high five and a salute with a sword. Oh, yeah, wrong character, wrong series. Then I will just salute you with a piece of bread, since I'm a farmer and colonist and frontiersman. Salute. Ooh, I guess I should eat. <laughs> All right, take care, and if you enjoyed this episode, as always, I would appreciate a like. And if not, then put in the comments what you didn't like. More than happy to listen. Oh, and finally, and finally, there was one more thing I wanted to talk about. In the last episode, I, I told you a little story about uh, Remy and uh, a night of gaming with my friends that didn't pan out quite so well. A lot of the comments were like, oh, so the moral of the story is don't have children or kids ruin all your fun. <laughs> no, that's not the moral of the story. Not at all. The moral of the story is be prepared to make adjustments. Kids modify your plans. And you just have to be prepared for it. That's all. Kids are fun. We've got plenty of fun stories to share with you, and I will do that in future episodes. So, all right, enough chatter. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.